Hey guys, uh, so I get asked a lot of questions about what's in my kitchen. So I always like to do these little Instagram reels about what's in my kitchen. So today I got a delivery from ButcherBox. Um, this is a um, certified B Corporation. If you know anything about certified B Corporations, these are sustainable. Um, they also meet all these other requirements for um, you know, so the social welfare of the, of the company, meaning they serve not only their shareholders, but they also serve their constituents. So uh, B certified companies just mean that they're not just organic, but they actually have a positive purpose on earth. They actually are a purpose-driven company. So I use ButcherBox. There's lots of different places where you can get good grass-fed, um, uh, grass-finished beef, um, wild-caught fish, and free-range pasture-raised chickens. Remember, you want chickens and cows and fish eating what chickens and cows and fish are meant to eat. They're not meant to eat corn syrup and antibiotics and grains. They're meant to eat grass and bugs and worms and things like that. Fish are actually meant to eat what's in their natural environment, and then when they excrete um, post-digesting uh, food, it sinks to the bottom of the ocean. It doesn't get recirculated and breathed back in like it does with farm-raised fish. So I like butcher box. Um, so I got a, a bunch of um, grass-fed, grass-finished. Don't forget, grass-fed does not mean it's grass-finished, meaning a lot of these cows are pasture-raised, and then when they bring them into the barns, they actually feed on grains, corns, and corn syrup. So remember, we're not what we eat, we're what we eat eats, what our food eats. Um, so it comes in a frozen package. Um, there's some nitrate-free bacons, uh, bacons, bacon. There's nitrate-free bacon, um, but also grass-fed, grass-finished ground beef. And this is actually high-fat beef. It only is 85% lean. I don't actually like the really, really lean um, meats because uh, the saturated fat in meat gets a bad rap. The truth is that saturated fat is fine for you if it's in the right fatty acid ratio. Remember, there's two types of these fatty acids you'll hear about all the time, omega-6 and omega-3. Generally, we want these in what's called a one-to-one -one ratio, one part omega-6 to one part omega-3. What's happened in industrial farming is the omega-6 content of fat has gone through the roof. So some of these food sources are 45 to one. Even though you want a one to one ratio, some of the meat has a 45 to one ratio. So when it's grass fed and grass finished, it, it gets closer to this one to one ratio. You're getting healthy amounts of omega-3 fatty acids. I mean, look at these steaks. These are the um, grass fed ribeyes, grass finished ribeyes. Um, and I've got the, um, there's chicken in here. There's wild caught fish. These are actually line caught um, fish that are in here. So wild caught salmon um, and other smaller fish that are wild caught and then are immediately uh, frozen and packaged. So they're, they're sent right to your house. So I really recommend these guys at the butcher box because I've, I've looked into the company, I've looked into their pricing and I've looked into the quality of their meats. And like I say, they're not the only ones on the market, but if you're looking for good grass fed, grass finished meat, um, look at the size of some of these fillets uh, that are grass fed and grass finished. So I just thought I'd give you a little tip on one of the places that I use to get uh, meat, chicken, fish, and steak, and let you know that these are they are very conscious about the fatty acid ratios in these meats so that when you eat them, you can eat them guilt-free. It's just science.